Hello and welcome back to Graveyard Keeper and we are in the middle of a dungeon because why not? I mean we need to we, we need to progress the the whole thing here so that's why we are down here Oh, this looks ugh, ugly. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, that, that was a really, really ugly situation. Uh, thankfully, we handled it decently not well i i would call that well but i was dealt with in a sort of decent manner and efficiency but um uh one thing i can say is that if you think that oh i'm not going to take any damage at all then think again most likely you will take damage the possibility of you taking damage is high very high now i'm not saying it's impossible to not take damage not at all it's most likely very possible to avoid all damage but i would not say that it's easy Some of the enemies um, is more uh, you have to get familiar with the attack pattern but s like certain situations like the combo of like the room composition can make it very hard if not even impossible to get through. Uh, what we should do here, I believe, is actually destroying the health powder because we have a lot of it. Uh, because this is what? Diamond. I, I suspected that it was diamonds. Yeah. This is turning out to be a great run. We got uh, on the first run before we went back uh, to do the sermon. We uh, found gold. And... Uh, Now we have silver, we have a lot of spider web, and we have five diamonds. That is a lot of diamonds. I don't think I ever, ever seen diamonds in the game. I think it's this is the first time. Now, I'm not going to progress any more. At least not for now. I think we have gone down. I, I need to recuperate and shove a bunch of stuff into boxes because uh, we have picked up a bunch of crap. Uh, so let's move all of this away in here. And you in here. <clears throat> Where did I have that? In there? Good. You in here. Okay, I can only have 30. 30. Okay, let's put the rest in here. I'm going to put eight silver nuggets in here because I need to possibly make more silver powder. And that means I need the nuggets. Now, the diamonds are going upstairs.
like in one of these boxes up here not sure exactly which one i think oops that one should be good enough let's have you make more onions if you please Yeah, getting the gold star seeds in the dungeon is also a very like a good re like a very good reason to actually go down there. I'm feeling hungry. Ah, what we need to do is sleep because of the debuff. I might just head straight down again. Uh, actually. <clears throat> yeah, uh, we are going to head down. I think floor 9. There are 25 floors which have increasingly difficult enemies. About that necklace, no. About the ritual, no. This stuff I'm looking for, take, no. Oh, okay. Floor 9. No, it's 15. It's not 25, it's 15. Now, I have, I think... Oh, right, this is the black slime thing. Which you need to be careful with because they shoot in an arc uh, but they only shoot up down left and right straight so if you carefully approach in a strategic manner you could avoid all damage and if you position yourself in a in a well um, manner in a, and in a good place then you could also avoid all damage here we go we get more gold which is so good so so good to actually get more gold Uh, huh? Yeah, we have filled up our inventory quite a lot, quite quickly. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah, here we have the big problem with their placement. And as in these rooms, like... Some of these rooms is just so bad with the black slimes shooting uh, because yeah they can reach some really like interesting distances and places uh, because they shoot three projectiles. There we go. I didn't take that much damage, which is really nice, to be honest. I want to try to avoid as much damage as possible because, yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And especially like you have bats which charge and 
spiders and a bunch of other nasty stuff which just can ruin your day uh, thankfully all of the pillars block the projectiles and they only reach a certain distance and they do they only f shoot like uh, a certain amount of time before they stop there are like you could say sort of a grace period where they don't shoot Uh, destroy the bat wings. This way, you could actually like zigzag to your enemy, like to the the black slime. Which could be useful. Now, we have a lot of black jelly. Uh, but... If it's enough... Uh, I'm not sure. We'll, we'll see. Uh, I We might need a lot of it. Ooh, might have to eat that. Wasn't really that good to take that amount of damage but with the bats being there uh like the bat being there i didn't want to risk anything so there we go that should be enough no i need to kill all of the enemies uh, because I missed someone somewhere, but most likely because uh, when it forked somewhere, yeah, we missed a room of or two. Let's get you over here. This is a good thing, like, make use of these, because that you they can't get to you through that. Uh... I'm trying to not concentrate too hard, like so hard that I forget to talk, but yeah, especially when the enemies come ar comes around, it's like, oh, I don't want to take a lot of unnecessary damage, so there, that, just that one room that was okay. That's absolutely fine and understandable. nothing should probably destroy that because we don't want oh we have the the orange jellies i don't think they have some like i don't think they are fundamentally different like the black one is Uh, but I might be wrong. Uh, it might just be that they do a lot more damage when destroyed it. That seed. Because the bronze seed is just meh. Whatever. Uh, we haven't taken that much damage. It's just the energy that sucks. Oh, 
Oh my god, could you please stop? Uh, that was a lot of unnecessary damage. Let's lure one of two up here. Oh, I got both of them. So good. Oh my god, no. Lag spike. Not good. The, ga the game is... Uh, I'm not sure if this part of the game is badly optimized or something. It might be. Oh. Now, I do think I should go back because of we have the debuff. We don't have a lot of this is not the correct way for going back. Uh, anything I can toss away the health powder the health powder can go away uh, I'm going to s let that be I don't need silver I, I only need gold to be honest so I'm not going to pick the silver if uh, I don't need to or I can't because I don't have any space. But yeah, I'm good. I need to go back. I don't have any energy. Uh, I have the debuff at this point, so I don't. I do want to get rid of it. I don't want to like just continue going through and wasting energy because of the debuff. I'm going to go down again and finish that floor, but that's it. Uh, then I'm going to take a break from the dungeon. Uh, we will need to continue doing the dungeon until uh, level 15. But I don't want to ju like just do the dungeon. Now we have had, we are on floor 10 and we have done a lot of dungeons uh, recently in the recent episodes. Uh, but that is mostly because we need to do the dungeon right now. So let's go down i think it was down that had yeah the unfinished room now i did not empty myself uh. Of course, I forgot to do something. Uh, I'm going to destroy the flitch. I can make infinite amount of flitch if I want to. So. Let's get the spider up here.
Here we go, all of them. Uh, where do we go? Which way? Is this the way for the room? All right. Um, open. It seems I'll need a key to go any deeper. I should ask Snake. All right, I can't actually go any deeper, even if I wanted to at this point. Okay, uh, that's good. It's good that I can actually, uh, I have I have actually gotten to this point, which means we will have some uh, questing to do to get ac gain access to the rest of it, which is that that that's good. That's good. There we go. I could have destroyed bat wings as well. The bat wings are more useless. Yeah, destroy the bat wings. I got the heal potion. That's good. That's what I wanted. Oops. Wasting energy. Yeah. I can't pick anything up, and the things I could have picked up, I don't really want. Like, I don't care about them. Uh, I'm not sure I have actually cleaned this floor up. I think if I go north here, we should find ourselves at least one more room to clear. To the right over here, we should probably have, yeah, one more. We have one more. Oh, that was a lot of damage. Uh, yeah, the flies do not soup like a ton of damage. They attack very quickly, though. Yeah. Wow. Uh, that was dodgy. Now, the orange... The orange jelly is something you need, so don't toss it away. Don't do that. You need to keep it. Make sure you pick up all of it. There's a reason why I picked uh, why I pick up all the jelly because they, especially, um, especially like the black and orange is going to be um, a low supply of until you gain the ability to and we got scary dungeon depths which i believe is get to floor 20 uh, floor 10 which i apparently has never gotten to which is beyond me now, what I need to do very quickly, or is it even any point of, like, is it, is there any point in doing that? Doing it? I, I might, I, I might have, might be some point in doing it. Uh, let's shove at least some things in here, not all of it. Pick up the teleport stone, go to the lighthouse. And boom. I have 50. So. Let's get. That book. That book. That book. And that book. It is expensive. Yes. And. 
For the red points, we actually don't need it. It's just the green and blue, which we are low on. So let's use it. How does it look right now? We have 255 green points, 141 blue points. Uh, yes, we're, we are going to do the complex fertilizer. Just no question. That's what we are going to do. Get the perk scientist. No, I think we'll wait uh, with that. Now, it will make alchemy more efficient and better. But I think... Uh, ooh, or do I even need to? Like, I could... I don't need green points for this, like the superpower of faith. Once I could just pick this one up, but I do want, like, I do need the green points for Surgeon, which might be better. Hmm. I'm not sure. But yeah, farming in nature is completely filled out. Um, uh, what do I want to pick? Uh, I mean, I could take the big guy like the perk because we get plus one damage and plus one defense and getting plus one defense is so useful if we are actually going to go deeper than level 10 of the dungeon but at the same time i'm not sure we'll see but we can't make any better like armor steel armor is the best kind of armor now Damask sword with gem is the the best sword you can get when it comes to damage. Now, why you would even want to make steel sword with gem is I think because you need it to make the damask sword with gem. I'm not sure. I've never I haven't even gotten the skilled casting <laughs> technology, so I'm not sure. This is probably as far as I have ever gotten. And a lot quicker than <laughs> that I otherwise have as well. So... Marble Columbarium would be good to get, but... That is not in the church, but in the graveyard. So I think we're just going to let it be. Uh, let's just head back. Tomorrow is church day, so... I will be able to show you... How ridiculously good the combo prayer is, but that is going to be in the next episode because we have one more one minute left so let's make use of this minute in a good manner now i'm going to go in here just very quickly and see yeah we had one crate just picked up the money uh We should make sure we have crates being made all the time, but uh, since we were in the dungeon for quite a long while, we um, didn't really do stuff other than other than the dungeon, to be honest. Like we did a dungeon, that's what we did. Um, 
We have a decent supply of peat again. That's good. Uh, I need to pick up all the stuff I put away, more or less, and... And I'm going to pick up the whetstone because it doesn't belong in that box. We are going to need to find a place for the black jelly and um, a bunch of other stuff. Uh, where did I, I put the gold there? I'm going to keep 10 gold nugget down here to make uh, gold powder from. Um, <clears throat> Let's put all the jellies in there. And that should be it. So I think we are going to end this by going to bed. Both to regain the energy and the HP that we lost. Now I'm not going to keep on recording. So... A bit of a recap and uh, we have we have finally reached the the dungeon floor of floor 10 so level 10 of the dungeon is reached and cleared now we can't go any further and we have we have made the combo prayer which Tomorrow is church day. We will use it. We have to get the church quality to 60 to guarantee a success. Now, to put in perspective, the church quality is 55 by default. So we have to use candles to increase the quality of the church. So we can actually guarantee that we succeed. <laughs> and what we need to do now is do the sermon with the uh, combo prayer, get that out of the way, and then we need to start doing all of these like quests and stuff uh, and the thing is since we have the combo prey faith will never ever be a problem again and money from the church will be a lot higher which means we have a steadier income of uh, money but what we need to do is when it comes to m earning money is getting the infrastructure up for the zombie production when it comes to the farm and <clears throat> the box making and all of that and then getting the tavern stuff up and running as well we have a bunch of stuff we need to do and we have a bunch of uh, people we need to talk to progress the story and the storyline and open up uh, other quests but with that we are going to end this here now so thanks for watching goodbye and i hope i'll see you in the next one